Traders and businessmen in Pakistan have expressed anger over rising inflation and unjust taxation policies as they struggle with the economic fallout from the COVID-19 pandemic. Chairman of Traders Association in Financial Capital Karachi slammed Prime Minister Imran Khan's government for failing to come up with progressive planning to tackle the crisis. Traders and businessmen in Pakistan have lamented they are struggling with economic fallout from the COVID-19 pandemic, rising inflation and unjust tax policies of the government and fear the worst for the future. According to reports, Pakistan's rupee hit a record low on Wednesday, closing at 177.43 against the US dollar on the back of a rising trade deficit. Pakistan's rupee has lost 12.6% of its value since July 1st, the start of the country's fiscal year. Sheikh Habib, chairman of a traders' association in Karachi, slammed Prime Minister Imran Khan's government and said it is not making any progressive plans to tackle inflation that is hitting the country's poor and middle classes really hard. Mengai ka jo selab hai, usne pehle hi smul ka diwariya nikal diya hai, aur main ye samajh raha hu ki jis tarah ki policies aur hukumatein vakt ki hai, main hi samajh raha hu ki mul khamara jo hai. खुदा न खासा खुदा न खासा डिफॉल्ट की तरफ जा रहा है इसलिए कि इनकी कोई प्लानिंग नजर नहीं आ रही है Meanwhile, according to a recent nationwide perceptions survey conducted by the Transparency International, 92.9% Pakistanis consider inflation and price hike to be the highest in the current PTI government. This coincides with 85.9% Pakistanis who say their income levels have rather squeezed and decreased over the last three years.